What's up, everybody? Me, Time Gaming, here bringing you our first part of our playthrough of uh, Pokemon Uranium. If you're ready, I'm ready. Time to roll the intro. Alright guys, like I said, this is Pokemon Uranium. This is a fan-made game. So uh, I borrowed it from the internet to see uh, what I can see or do in this game. Because I really love Pokemon. My, I, the first one I played personally was Pokemon Red. And I enjoyed them ever since. So there's a lot of stuff going on. I didn't read up anything on it. So you're going to see uh, pretty much... I'm going to see the first uh, stuff for the first time as you see it for the first time. So uh, I know... I think there's an obviously enough uh some sort of uh uh nuclear thing going on i'm guessing so let's get started all right let's choose our game mode we'll play regular mode are you sure you want to play this mode yes huh who is it oh hello there welcome to the world of pokemon my name is bumbo bambo er, but if you find it hard to pronounce you can just call me the pokemon professor well, sir, you're one hip, hipstery-looking professor, that's for sure. You're the kid who's applying for a job, right? Great. Want to low down on what you'll be doing? Uh, since I'm assuming it's going to be pretty much like every other Pokemon game that's ever existed, I'll just go no info needed. We human share the world with creatures known as Pokemon, or Pokemon for you people from outer regions. More than more mere animals, Pokemon possess astonishing, uh, astonishing powers and remarkable intelligence. People in Pokemon coexist in many ways. Some Pokemon are kept as pets, others help with us with work, and still others are used in battle by trainers such as yourself. Am I doing research or am I doing? Okay. But there's so much we will we don't know still about Pokemon. I'm just adding words here. That's my job. I study Pokemon for a living, especially. I'm an expert on Pokemon elements. Every Pokemon, has an, uh, every Pokemon has an element type, and each type has its own strength. And weaknesses, of course. But why do they exist? Are they new types we haven't discovered yet? <laughs> uh, but I'll, I'll tell you more if, if, uh, but I'll tell you more at your first day on the job. Report to my lab tomorrow and get your first Pokemon. Now you just fill out this form here. Who are you? Uh, we will go with uh, Mr. Nice Haircut here. Sure, yes. Uh, his name is Johnny. Your name is Johnny? Yes, it is. Are you, are you ready? Of course. Your journey, your story is about to unfold. So dramatic. The future is a blank slate. You, together with your Pokemon, are going to fill it. There will be challenges and thrills, and you'll be bound to to make exciting discoveries. You and you're bound to make exciting discoveries. Sorry. Let's go. Ten years ago, Johnny's family lived in Beale Beach City, the largest city in Tandor. Do -do 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 -do. Their father, Kellen was a brave and talented Pokemon Ranger. I don't know what a Pokemon Ranger is. Their mother, Lucille, was a brilliant scientist and an expert, an expert on nuclear energy, of course. Although they both worked demanding jobs, they always found time to spend at home with young Johnny. All right. The Tender Ranger was at peace and Lucille Company was working on a form of clear, clean energy that would change the world. The future seemed bright until dot dot dot. It was an ordinary day at the nuclear power plant where Lucille worked. As part of a routine inspection, they brought in a specialist to take all, a look at the electrical system. Cameron, have you finished your diagnostics? Yes, I have. Everything seems to be working perfectly. This is generator you designed really does its job well, Seal. Excellent. Is everybody has finished 
If everybody has finished their work, we'll break for lunch. Yeah, uh, boss, you might want to take a look at this. That's never a good thing. Strange. The temperature reading is far higher than normal. Either we need to reset the thermos thermometer, or... The reactor is leaking a massive amount of heat. It can't be the thermometer. I've checked that. Just checked that, so... Dot, dot, dot. Oh. Uh-oh. Must be a breach in the reactor. At this temperature, in just a few minutes, we'll have a total meltdown. Oh no! Everybody needs to evacuate. No! Sorry if I'm. I think I'm screaming a bit louder than usual. Lucille, you have to leave too. Dot dot dot. Lucille. With cameras help, all of the scientists were able to escape unscattered. Unscared scat. Except Lucille. She was never seen again after that day. Oh no. The radiation leaking from the broken reactor mo made the surrounding area inhabitable for many years. Foiling any attempt to try and search for her. The loss of his, the loss of his wife had a profound effect on Kellen. His personal change, his personality changed. He became cold and dedicated to his work, his job. In time, he got promoted to chief of the Tandor Pokemon Rangers. However, he became too busy, too busy to take care of his child. So young Johnny was sent to live with their elderly auntie in Moki Town, Moki Town, or Moki Town. Ten years passed. Auntie Health Wan waned. Supporting a child was too much work for her. Fortunately, Ernest Bambo, the local Pokemon professor, was looking for a research assistant. Two kids from Moki Town applied Johnny and their childhood friend Tio. It was common for youth of a certain age to receive a Pokemon and travel the region as a Pokemon trainer. And so, jo Johnny's journey began. Johnny, come downstairs. You are late. Okay. Oh, okay, cool. So we're using the the keep the um, the arrow keys for this. We're not using WASD. Oh wait, is there something special? I always remember there's. Uh, it's crammed full of books about Pokemon. Me, my own, blah 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 blah. Okay. To make sure we're not forgetting something here. Remember. In, I remember in some other games you had like secret items, if I remember. Item storage. Alright. Do I have mail? There's no mail here. God damn it. Turn off PC. Alright, let's go. That's nice little music. Keep in mind, keep in mind too. This is a fan-made game, so it's pretty nice looking so far. Johnny, sweetie, today's your big day, isn't it? I can't help but feel glum seeing my little one all grown up and leaving home. Oh, if only these old bones could do more so that I could support us both. But we both know that uh, that you're ready for this, and you, that boy Tio, always following in your footstep. That one. You've always been so capable, but I wonder about him. He's younger after all. I'm sure his father Cameron wouldn't, wouldn't allow him to go unless he was sure. Anyway, to celebrate your big day, I got you a present. Go ahead and open it. John obtained her running shoes. Yay! To run, hold Z. Okay. Can, can toggle all run in the menu. Okay. Sniffle. <laughs> Uh-oh, don't mind me, sweetie. I'm just a bit emotion an emotional old lady. If only your father were here right now. Well, I'm sure he'd be proud of you, too. I'm s I'm and I'm so positive you'll run into him during your adventure. Now, I should keep you any longer. Say hi to the nice professor man for me, will you? And if you don't mind stopping by again after you get your first Pokemon, I'd love to see it. Good, good luck, sweetie. 
Kane of Emotions. Hey, wait up! Oh god. Where do you think you're going, huh? Are you trying to get the lab before me? So you can get the better Pokemon? Well, ain't gonna happen. Because I'm gonna get the strongest one first. Try to keep up, Johnny. No! Hey, isn't it? If it isn't Johnny and uh, your friend, Tommy, was it? Honestly, honestly, Pops, you can't even remember my name. It's Tio. Tio! Right, Tio, just in time. Today is a very special day for both of you. It's your first day at work as field research assistant at Bombo Pokemon Research Labs. Your job will be have traveling across Tandor. Observing, capturing many different kind of Pokemons helped me with my research on Pokemon elements. I have three Pokemons here that will aid you on your journey. Before you get your starter, though, you be both taking po you both be take the Pokemon Trainer Aptitude Test. Test? I didn't study for any tests. I thought you were going to give us a rare, powerful Pokemon. Now, now, don't worry. It's not that kind of test you have to study for. Just a way to determine what kind of Pokemon trainer you will be. Different starter Pokemon are better suited for different battle wing styles. The starter Pokemon will be your lifelong partner, so it's important to, for you to work well together. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Enough talking. I want to get my Pokemon. <laughs> Sorry about that. Jeez. Kid, you're not very patient, are you? Alright. If you want to know more about what's on the test before we begin, you can talk to my, my aide now. Johnny, are you ready to take the trainer's aptitude test? Yes, I am. Excellent. So without further ado... When you come to a new kind of Pokemon in the wild, what is your first reaction? Oops. Very good, both of you. I... 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 Come on, that was easy. Give me a tougher one. I didn't even see the question. I'm so sorry. Okay, okay next question then. Which of these TMs would you prefer to teach your Pokemon? Hyper Beam, Protect... Hidden power. Hyper Beam. Hey Professor, what's a TM anyway? Um, I'll tell you later. Let's move on to the next question, shall we? What should a Fallout Pokemon would win an all-out battle? Gyarados, of course. Is it possible to fail the test? No, it is. It isn't. Now, this is your final question. So answer honestly. What's your motivation for becoming a Pokemon trainer? No question about it. I'm going to be a Pokemon master. Ain't nobody got to st stand in my way. Huh. I dig your spirit, kid. Well, that's it for the Pokemon aptitude test. The trainer aptitude test. Now it's time to analyze your result. Boop, 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 boop. Okay, I finished my analysis. My analysis. Give me the damn fire Pokemon. Fire po Johnny? You seem to be a trainer who won't hesitate to do what... To go for what you want prefer to overwhelm your opponent with sheer force and firepower. To say the best defense is a good offense is probably your m mantra. Of course it is. You have a burning spirit within you that never ceases. For an offensive trainer like you, yes, Raptorch is the best pick. Now I don't know w which generation Raptorch is or if it's a new Pokemon in this game, but it looks pretty cool though. Go ahead and take it, Johnny. Rap torch. Yes. Would you like to give a nickname to your Raptors? No. Hey, I'm tired of waiting. Johnny, get there started already. When in the do when do I get mine? I'm done as in result, Tio. Um Give him the shitty fucking Plant Pokemon. Tio? Well, you certainly know what you want out of life. You're impulsive and patient and care mostly about your own desire. But I sense something else is in you. Could it be the seed of greatness? The potential of transform yourself completely? Or maybe it's just there. 
that you're young, I can't tell. Regardless, for a trainer like you, you got the plant Pokemon. Horchin is the best pick. That's what you get. You get the sucky Pokemon. The one, the Pokemon nobody takes. The plant Pokemon. Or leaf Pokemon. One. Yes, my first Pokemon. Johnny, you have a Pokemon and now I have a Pokemon too. You know what time it's, you know what this means, right? We have to battle. Oh, please, not in the lab. Dun, 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 dun. Johnny versus Teal. Oh, you're gonna get it now. Rival Teal would like to battle. Rival Teal sends out Orchid. Go, Raptorch. Uh, fight bag Pokemon. Scratch. Growl Amber. Scratch. The four. It's not very- what? I'll try Amber on this. Amber will burn this fucking plant. Whoa! Super effective! You're full on orchid fainted. Rap Torch gained 75 XP points. Johnny defeated rival Teal. What? But but I was supposed to win. Johnny got through. Yeah! Give me your money, punk! How? I'm supposed to be the b best trainer ever. That's p impossible. Good trainers never l lose. I, I, well, of course you little crybaby. Please don't cry, Teo. Hey, here, I'll heal your Pokemon for you. Your Pokemon was, were healed. Yay. 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 I w wanted to be an unbeatable trainer. How come I couldn't win? I really, really wanted to win. Well, between your starter and Johnny, there's has a type advantage. Water beats fire, fire beats grass, and grass beats water. That's the element type for a triangle. Well, one of them, at any rate. Learning to master type matches up an important part of being a trainer. N no way, I want a do-over. How come Johnny gets the better starter? Wah, it's it isn't fair. I'm I'm going home. Yeah, you go home, you crab Abby. <sighs> he took the harder the harder than I hoped. He took that harder than I hoped. But you shouldn't be so quick to judge him. He's just a kid after all. I expect he'll soon discover that training Pokemon isn't as easy as that he, as he imagined. I'm going out for an interesting route one by the edge of town. Bring Theo, and I'll teach you both how to catch Pokemon. See you later, Johnny. Moki Town. Okay, we'll go see Grandma, because that's what she asked us to do. Oh, honey, you came back to say goodbye. How sweet. Is that your Pokemon? What is it called? Raptorch? It's so cute. Come back when you need a rest, or if you just want to humor your old aunt. Alright. That's it? No present? Hey there, Johnny. I want to show you and Tio how to catch Pokemon. Can you get him? Go get him? Should be in his house. Which one is this fucking house? Is it the What did you say to my son? He ran upstairs crying and locked the door behind him. He won't tell me what's wrong. Or come downstairs. I swear, if you did anything to hurt him. Dot dot dot. Oh. So that's how it is. So you got a weaker star and you beat him in a battle. Hmm, I see. That explains it. A harsh lesson to be sure, but losing is as much as part of being a trainer as winning. He had his heart set in the right on this day being perfect so losing right off the bat is somewhat of a shock 
Still, crying won't solve anything. That's something he has to learn. Dio! Come downstairs right now, young man! Sniffles. Tio, you can't cry every time you lose a battle. That's just part of being a trainer. But, but it isn't fair, Jenny got the better starter and me. No, I'm never gonna win. Then you'll have to catch more Pokemon to balance out your team's weaknesses. Besides, a well raised Pokemon can still win even at, the, at a disadvantage. There's no sense in giving up before you even begin. Yes, yes, Dad. Now, Tio, I won't, I won't always be around to pick you up when you're fa feeling down. So try and be strong for yourself, okay? Johnny, please be patient with my son. He looks up to you, you know. Okay. Oh, I nearly forgot, Johnny. Tio, I have something for both of you. Uh, l like a present? Yes, exactly. Johnny, your father come and sent me these and told me to give them to both of to you both when began your journey. I'm sure it will come in useful. Receive Pokepod. What the fuck's a Pokepod? Pokepod, what's that? There you go. It's a high-tech device that's in indispensable for Pokemon trainers. It plays music and includes a map of the region. Most importantly, it contains a phone that will allow you to ye stay in touch with each other and other Pokemon trainers. Cool, hee <laughs> hee. I got the red one. It's cooler than yours. It's gonna go meet... I'm gonna go meet the professor. By the edge of town. I'll be the first to catch a Pokemon. Bye, Dad. Keep up, Johnny. No! Well, talk about a dramatic, a dramatic turnaround. He'll always bounce back quickly. Johnny, you don't want to keep Presser waiting. So you should go mo moving, too. I won't see you and you again for time. For some time. You see, I'm starting a new job soon. I'm supervising the construction of a new power plant, Epsilon. E Epsilon, yeah. And I'll see it. Perhaps I'll see you there in time. After all, it's the last place Lucille was ever seen. Dot dot dot. That's a look of. That's a look on your journey, Johnny. Hey there, Johnny. How do you and Tierra here? It's time to begin your first lesson as a Pokemon trainer and field research aide. Now watch closely. Wild Pokemons are probably already known and inhabit tall grass. But that's not the only place. You can also find them in caves and water, or even in cities if you know where to look. Still, tall grass is going to be your best bet to finding new Pokemon. Simply take a few steps in and... Look, it's a wild... Chin Monk. They're very common around here. It hasn't noticed me yet, so now my chance. Go, Ele Elixir. This little guy was the other starter Pokemon you could have to retrieve. I think he's taking a shine to me, and I'd rather like him too. So I'm gonna keep him. Now, the next step is to weaken the enemy Pokemon to make it easier to catch. Alexa, use tackle! Cheen! Now that's the weak. Now it's weakened, now it's my chance to catch a Pokemon Go! And that's how it's done. Now, Chinmuk is, is f are fairly easy, but you'll sure to encounter even other Pokemon that are a lot harder to capture. For those, you might need to inflict them with status effect or use a special Pokeball. But I'm sure you'll get the hang of it before too long. Yay, Pokedex! That Pokedex is actually that will automatically update itself whenever you encounter or catch a new Pokemon. It's very important for my research, so make sure it fills out as much as possible. Also, I want you to have these. Same Pokeballs, of course. Johnny puts Pokeball in Pokeball pocket. Pokeballs are necessary for catching Pokemon, of course. What's the thing the kids always say? Gotta catch them all? God damn it. You ran out, you can pick up some more at any Pokemart. Mokotown doesn't have one of those, but there's one in Kevlar Town on the other side of Route 01. So, with that said, your lessons now are. Oh, but two have Pokepods, don't you? Here, let's me input my number. Yay! 
can give me a call anytime. I'll take a look at how your Pokedex is coming along. You do a good job collecting many different kind of Pokemon. I might even have special rewards for you. Yay! With that said, I'm going back to my lab. Best of luck to you, both of you. Both of you. So I might have rambled the last part there, but... Johnny, I don't care that you got the stronger starter. I'm still going to be the best trainer ever. I'll catch tons of Pokemon and we'll win every battle. Just wait and see. Fine. Okay, let's try to catch our first Pokemon and then I think we'll call it a... Kabam, Kabam, Cubug, Go Rap Torch. Fight, Scratch. Don't kill him. Oh, Charm. Oh no. I think I can. Stop that! One more, one more. Don't kill him, don't kill him. You tackle me. Oh, don't kill him. Let's catch our first Pokemon. Yay, we got him. Kabug. Alright, we got him. Number 12. Choose characters with bugs and mammal Pokemon being in presence. Alright, that's going to be it for our first uh, playthrough of uh, Pokemon Uranium. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. It's, it's fun. It's uh, the For a user-made game, it's very fun to play. Um, so far, I only, I only did the tutorial and caught one Pokemon so far, so that's pretty cool. These are Pokemons I don't know, of course, so it's going to be a lot of learning the new names and stuff. And uh, yeah, so hopefully... <laughs> Hopefully my video won't get pulled down for a game not an official, but I see a lot of video of this game, so I shouldn't have any problem. Hopefully that you guys enjoyed. If you enjoyed, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, of course. Follow me everywhere, me time, give me on Twitch, Twitter, Facebook, and right here, YouTube.com, where you can watch all the other videos I do every day, the week, Monday to Friday, 10 p.m. Eastern Time. 10, sorry, 10 a.m. Eastern Time. So thank you so much, guys, for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Keep on keeping on.